A survey of Year 12 students found that 42% registered anxiety symptoms high enough to be of clinical concern. So I thought I'd go to a school to help them get over themselves. <laughs> There's a lot of pressure on students to do well in exams. And that's good, isn't it? Because it sorts out the wheat from the chaff. Exams are not the making of a person. Exam results are not going to identify those who are going to be most successful in life. Don't you think it's good to crush their dreams early so they don't waste <laughs> the rest of their life having dreams that can't be fulfilled? Absolutely not, Tom. How are you? <laughs> Study hard. G'day, kid. <laughs> How do you help your students relax? They do um, sport, music, they go to the park occasionally. The Year 12s have access to the park across the road. Yeah, for a quick sig. No, they don't smoke. Our children but that's are very relaxing, health conscious. Oh, no, no. It that's... relieves stress. If they're really stressed, we have a meditation room at the school. It's well known that it helps them focus on their study or helps them to relax in times of high stress and pressure. So they just go and sit in there and procrastinate? <laughs> and just sit in there and pretend they don't have exams. Hello, this is Tom Gleeson here, just reminding you all that with your exams, everything's riding on it. There are no second chances. <laughs> Don't forget to study, yeah? Okay, sure. Don't f up, all right? <laughs> Students who are suffering from high anxiety get to sit their exams in a separate room. How can you tell the difference between a student who's suffering from high anxiety and a student who's just shit at exams? Special provision is a, ent an entitlement for kids who've had a history of um, anxiety and medical, medically diagnosed um, situations. I've heard you can get other people to do exams for you if you've got poor handwriting. It would have to be a medically diagnosed um, disorder. But how, how do you diagnose it? Do you just go into the doctor and go, hey, doc, look at this? Not at all. <laughs> no, no, Tom. You get a certificate? No. That's misspelled? No. The principal was loving my no-nonsense approach to Year 12 anxiety, so she asked me to address the school assembly. We are very pleased to have a special guest with us this morning, Mr Tom Gleeson. I know a lot of you are stressed about the Year 12 exams, well, I'm here to tell you, you should be. Because if you stuff them up, you will ruin your entire lives. People will tell you that even if you get a bad score in your exams, you can still go on to have a successful career. Well, the only people that say that are usually people who have missed out on following their dreams. Of course, I'm talking about teachers. <laughs> who wants to be a teacher? You get paid bugger all, and then you have to come back to work here at this shithole. <laughs> So the lesson to take home from today is you should be stressed. You should be. There will be people that say that it's OK if you can't handle the pressure. or well, those people are losers! <laughs> and you want to be a winner! So my lesson here today for you is don't f*** up! <laughs> I actually brought a T-shirt to uh, hand to the principal today. Um... <laughs>